Hi guys, um, this is a new version of Hyperland. It's 0.23 and because of it we've got a lot of issues. Frozen we've called it, instead of Hyperland, Frozen Land. A week long I've been looking at what might cause it with this transition from 22 to 23 and I hope I found it. So this one is still in the test repos and will continue probably for another week and see if it freezes at some point in time. The topic of the video is somebody a question about Deluge. Now Deluge is an application to torrent. So yay and then torrent and you have a look at what's possible already to just click. So number one, I installed that one and also number GTK, where are you my friend? There is a Deluge GTK as well, which I do not see at this point in time, but it is. So both of them have been installed. And if you say, we can have a look like this, sudo pacman minus s Deluge. If we do GTK, we get the dependency in, right? We get Deluge in, so it's already installed. A super D is gonna open up our Deluge BitTorrent client and there is so much more. Now some of the applications that's important for you to know and that's why for me anyway Wayland will still be a plaything and never a work thing because there will be applications that simply do not work. Point. They will not work. So it's um, try it out and, and see if you like it. That's uh, what we are telling you. Play with it and then say goodbye to it. Downloads. Let's try to download one of our torrents. So on FOSS torrents, there are lots of torrents. Well, all of them all, all are there. If we uh, want our own torrents, we can get those as well, but they're only for the XL, the D, the XS, XS, LTS, basically the core ISOs. So the Bs, if you want to have not a source forge or a um, click, just a simple file, you click and you download, but if you really want a torrent, and that's what we want to do, right? Delusion, and then we go for one of those guys. And it has, and as you see, there are many, many, many inter and, um, well distributions and have a look and see what you like. Oh, this, this is nice. Eric the was informed that some of the custom apps Arsling Suite Tool won't work on Wayland, right? And so many more. So yeah, um, let's get ourselves something in. So this button says core ID, name and so on. We click and we're awesome. Didn't know that. I guess we are. Can we drag it, drag and drop it? Yes, we can drag and drop, boom. And off it goes. So this is a test to quickly show, look, the loser works, right? Now by default, we have this Cupid torrent. And in the past we had transmission. It is a choice, nothing more than that. It's a choice. Choose whatever you want, right? Choose whatever works for you. Let's put it somewhere else so it can come in on the desktop, for example. What? Check. Stalled. Downloading. Two seats, 28 people, and so on. And the speed goes up. It, uh, if you download it from our seat host, it's around 45 megabits per, sec per second. And here it's uh, 26 now. And of course, we're downloading together, which may indicate, right? Just uh, add them to each other. Run 30, it seems to be 30, 35, as in speed. Voila, just a quick test. Delusion and Qubit Torrent, both of them are already supported on Wayland. That's important for you to know. That's the difference, Wayland. All right, cheers.